There was a lady who got her head chopped off. That's right, people. She got her head chopped off by a samurai sword by her crazy Mexican boyfriend. Now, this lady's white who uh, got her head chopped off, but her crazy Mexican boyfriend chopped her head off. Now, the video in the description below, um, I assume what the news clip said that they went back and forth with Oregon and she was going to tell it about those allegations to what he had did, had had sex with a minor or something like that. But people, that is uncalled for to chop somebody's head out of a samurai so People, 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 leave these unstable people alone. Obviously, this Mexican guy, he looked like he was crazy. Now, people. He went back to his car and chopped her head off with a samurai saw. Or it could have been a, a hacksaw. Who knows what it was? The news clip said it was a samurai saw, but I don't really know what the heck it was. It could have been a Jason knife. One of them sharp Jason knives. It could have been. And chopped her head, slap off, head hit the ground like some sort of horror movie. People, that guy right there deserved to get thrown away forever. He deserves to get his head chopped off. People, if these allegations are true, then he do, he deserved to go to jail for having sex with a minor. You know, what you need a minor for if, if you got this grown ass woman right here, you know? What is the purpose of that? People, there is a lot of abusive men out here. They will do anything and everything to control you, you know, to set you up. See, some people don't be lying when they say they're gonna kill you. They said they're going to kill you. Some people might just do it, you know, people. But it's very sad, man. It's very sad. Um, my heart goes out to this lady family, man. I hope this Mexican guy get thrown behind bars forever and get the execution chair. You know, that's what he need, man, for, for killing Chopper's lady head off for no reason. People, leave the thugs alone. Leave thug dick alone. Leave these horrible... No good for men alone. Or get you somebody respectful. But apparently women don't want nobody respect, respectful. They want thugs all the damn time. They want thugs. Sad, sad. My heart goes out to the girl, to the woman's family. Because nobody don't deserve to die in this type of way. Or any way in that matter. But people, stay vigilant. And if somebody say they're going to get you. You know, you need to take that, that threat to heart. You know, you never know, because some people might mean that crap for real. Some people just don't be talking. So, stay vigilant. Get your gun, taser, or something to protect yourself. And if you are in an abusive relationship, you need to do everything and everything to get the fuck out. Run for the hills. Call the cops or something to protect yourself. Restraining artists normally don't work though. You know, people always stalk with people every single day. But people, people, get your gun preferably. You got a gun, use your second amendment of right to protect yourself. And once you kill this person, you sit down well on the police and tell the police why you did it. Because you felt like your life was in danger when the police say they feel like their life in danger. So you got all the means and all the rights to take somebody's life if they beating your ass. They trying to kill you. They threaten you. You know what I'm saying? But people, people, people. My heart goes out to the lady family though, man. Sad, sad, sad. I love those who love me. Don't forget, you guys. Jesus Christ is king.